everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be combining polymer clay with 2D animation. Um, this is inspired by the TV show Amazing World of Gumball. If you don't know what that is, it's it's a TV show, it's an animated TV show, and it has um, like different styles of animation. So like there's like 3D, 2D, and they even incorporate like um, real life scenes. If you know, if you've seen the show, you know what I'm talking about, and I wanted to try it for myself. So I made this um, fairy girl, and I took pictures of her outside so I could have like the background scene. But she doesn't have eyes, a mouth, or wings, and I plan on animating this. So yeah. So um, I started animating it right, and I made the entire canvas and like added all like the layers. And it, this is the layer list if you want to know what I did. But it turns out my thing crashed and it didn't show um, how I did the eyes, but pretty much like the open eyes are just dots and like the blinking eyes are um, just like oval things. I don't really know how to explain it. And I messed up the eye blinking because like obviously people don't like blink. Like we do blink a lot, but like I couldn't figure it out. So it's just, it's fine how it is, but you know. I also figured out how to add like extra, um, frames for each thing so I started messing around with that because um I didn't really know how to do that until like now um yeah this I'm still experimenting with the program and this is like I think this is like the first thing I've done but I tried to redo my intro but that didn't really work out very well so yeah also don't be fooled about how fast the exporting goes it actually takes a long time depending on what you've done so this is um, all sped up by a lot and my original footage was like a half an hour long and it was wild. Also this is me making the mouth part and surprisingly this part was actually really easy compared to doing the eyes. And yeah it's not perfect but I like how it like turns out. I also figured out how to use the lasso tool to duplicate my drawings. And this was very helpful to use, but I couldn't figure out how to use, like, how to duplicate the individual um, frames. So I just got stuck with, like, repacing everything. And, I mean, it worked out fine in the end. It's just I have to learn how to use the app correctly. I mean, I have watched videos, um, but I think using it will be better for me to learn how, if that makes any sense. So next up I am going to start working on the wings and originally I wanted the wings to like flap like wings do but I couldn't figure out how to do that so I just ended up making them like grow, grow bigger if that makes any sense but eventually I'll figure out how to do that but I think um, like the wings look pretty good for like my first try time trying to do that. Also, um, like the colors that I'm using, uh, mainly for the eyes and the wings, are like the sage color that I used for her, um, her leaves on her like shirt or her uh, dress and her shoes. Mainly, I wanted to keep everything consistent. And for the mouth, I just use a brown color. And I use the eye drop color, by the way, so to get the same color as the leaf. I think one of my favorite parts about this whole thing was making like the glitter stuff. So the first thing I really did was make the stars and I just did two stars and then I duplicated it and I just like rotated them a little bit. I wish I made like the frames um, longer in between. I can probably go fix that but yeah. I was 
also gonna end up doing like this dotted glitter I'm not really sure how to explain it but I ended up not doing that because I couldn't figure out like which way I wanted it to go and I didn't look up any references which I probably should have if I wanted to do it but instead I ended up going for these um like these I don't like these sparkle things like the sparkle emoji and I ended up hand drawing each one and it actually looks really good in the end you'll you'll see it it, it kind of reminds me of like um when people use like the handwritten titles and like the letters like look different and you can see them like moving slightly that's like the look I was going to do and this is like the final animation I will be posting it on Instagram on my reels if you guys want to see it closely so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you all next time. Bye!